So, um, I was sitting here, um, for one, I just, for first off, actually, I just want to, um, bless everybody, bless, um, you know, the Mother Divine and Holy Spirit, and thank you, uh, for the passing and ascension and, uh, blessing of our dear friend, my dear friend, and, uh, of all of our dear friends, Carmen Harrison, this beautiful soul, and, um, <laughs> Yeah, I know he's still here, but and I'm I was grateful and happy that I was uh, I arrived in time to be with him till his passing and help him ascend in this new list. <laughs> See why. Um that's um that what I actually wanted to to say is um I just seen something online about um teachers or doctrine or schooling or something but I was thinking that you know Adam and Eve they ate the apple right the apple that uh that fell them that fell them from heaven being a fallen angel and uh they they went and ran they had clothes they went and put on clothes because they've hidden the truth from you they've hidden the truth from you because the fallen angel came to earth right mm -hmm. they've been willing for the devil that ate the, the apple, but then think, who is it that receives the apple all the time? Tell me. Maybe the doctrine, the teachers, the tree of knowledge of good and evil. And that's sign, signs, everywhere sign. It's blocking out the scenery and breaking our minds. And we need to really we really need to stand, unite, and love. Because we are the electoral government. We are the government. We're the electoral government. We are the people. We are it. The system, the service, the the um, civil servants. I'm sorry, but whether they wear a badge, whether they wear a color, and in fact, they, you know, when they wear a badge, umbrella, or a badge, a color are the same, and the guns and the uh, equipment. You guys are the gangs. You guys are the gangs. Not us. We are the free civilians. We are the government. And you have tyrannized us. You have about done enough killing to us and doctoring us and pushing meth onto our kids. All those pills, guys, that you are feeding into your kids, that's meth amphetamines. That is meth that is killing the people on the streets. That is from the government. And this has all been doctrined. The MDMA that they say on the news. I read the news, or I watched the news the other day, and they were trying to say ascension and shaman and all this. And they're like, oh, don't use shrooms. Not the plants. Not the, you know, Mother Earth, the elementals. You know, like Super Mario Brothers. <laughs> like the flower people, the flower children, the flower, the stars, the mushrooms make Super Mario. No, don't do that. That's not proper, right? So they're trying to, like, sit there and talk about how MDMA is used, and MDMA should be used, and MDMA has methamphetamine in it, okay? Meth has been pushed into everything, and so has Oxycontin, which they made, fentanyl, which they made, car fentanyl, which they made, and they did this after the revolution in the, the Second World War, when they also were pushing meth onto your soldiers to make them fight longer and harder and just die, 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 die. Um, it is time we wake up. Like, teachers, leave those kids alone, along with the system. Leave us alone. The doctrines, leave us alone. We are the people, we are the government, and we say no, no more. No more will we fall for you. No more will you make us fall. No more will my friends I see die from your falling. You were the one that fell. The people in the streets, the ones that, when the people in the homes and the ripped apart homes, God forbid you guys are so inhumane. You have corrupted and crushed and Malcolm X divided everybody to so badly. And, and it's, you know, it's in your face now. It's too obvious. This game is over. The game is over. Okay, Super Mario Brother has ascended all the levels. The one-ups here and the one-ups here. It's that time, guys. Okay, we made it through all of them. We got to, what is it, how many levels? Into the King's Bowser's Castle. We know where you are. We know what you are. We know what is going on. And we're about tired of it. We are tired of living in your corrupt 
corrupt, very low level, low conscious living. We're better than that. We are beings of love and light. We are love. And we are love, always. <laughs> and that's, you know why you have free will, guys? We were given free will to have free choice. But that means that your ancestors of spirit realms, your divine, your Lord, your holy, your trinity, the spiritual guides that are around you, they are not allowed by universal law to interfere with your free will until you ask for it. Therefore, what you can't see, you don't know what to ask for when they're trying to take God out of the system, when they take the Bibles out of the fucking schools and they ban the ban God out of everything. They ban the Bible out of Canada. They're trying to take, they took Canada, they changed their national anthem. They're trying to take man and woman out because it is a part of God and thus is also the part of the Reds and Turner and Britons, which doesn't even exist because they're words that they actually doctrined onto us to think that we are less than the divine. See, we don't need to be government because we are all. We are all that is, was, and ever will be. The constant cycle and recycle of now. It's a, It never changes. It's ever changing, but it's always now. And it's manifested energy. And we energy that manifests constantly over and over and over. But I can guarantee you we need to stand together at this spiritual all-for-one awakening. That's what it is. See, I've gone through spiritual ascendance, and I know that... I get choices in spiritual realms, and I make them first. I, I, it's not like I got the choice, and I'd seen here. You know, you give a, you know, you get your consequences. You know, but you know, in this revelations, we did. We, you know, thankfully, thankfully, we did. Kinda, you know, if you look it up, if you look through all of everything, and you, you research, you'll find we have the answers, and it's been given to us. Not on your mainstream media. That's all doctrine and paid for, my dear, by the by the elite, by all the essential, you know, businesses that are putting you out of your home and your business and tearing your family apart. I know this as everything I'm telling you is with when it is within my experience in my life as of now. I see and I know and I have I've been gifted all of it to know now at this time to tell you. This is the truth. This is my truth. And it says, you know, I didn't come here to fool you. I came here to tell you the truth. Just like hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. I've heard there was a secret chord, maybe 432 hertz of freaking, you know, harmonic tone, that David played, and it pleased you, Lord. It made us happy, it made everything happy, harmonic tone. It goes like this, the fourth, the fifth, straight ahead, guys, straight on, always forward. The rise, the fall, and then the switch. The constant renewal and over and over, everlasting, ever changing, but cycling infinite. The baffled king, he was composing, maybe now singing, hallelujah. <laughs> you saw her there on the roof, Bathing on the roof naked, actually. I was the king that seen the girl naked on the roof. You know, he uh, his eyes were casted. Yeah, he was drawn. And thus, I believe this is a true story of the ancient Noir being a king in the folk. So we saw her bathing on the roof. Her beauty in the moonlight overthrew you. Overthrew you. Turned you right over through, through your... Overthrew your... Uh, your... Authority overthrew you and casted you. <sighs> she tied you to that kitchen chair. She stole that throne and she cut your hair. And from your lips she drew. She took it. She drew that in hallelujah. She took your words, buddy. We have been witchcraft and we have been overturned. We have been hoodwinked. Now, I know I've been here before. Oh, wait, yeah, the other one was actually... The second one started with, you've had your faith, but you needed proof. You saw her bathing on the roof. And then it's, I know I've been here before. I've seen this room and I've walked this floor. Trust me. I didn't come here to fool you. I'm telling you the truth and I didn't come here to fool you. <laughs> I tried to feel... I couldn't feel, but I tried to touch. I oh, know, I, I didn't come here to fool you. And then 
says. <sighs> it's it's uh, not a it's not any kind of it's not any kind of victory. It's a cold and it's a very broken hallelujah. Hmm. It all makes sense, guys. Come on, let's realize. Realize all the real lies we've been living. Stand and unite because if divide we fall and that's fallen angels, guys, because that's what we are. We are the divine and divine loves us so. All it is is seeking it. Everybody's lost knowledge of it because they've taken it away from you, just like those prophecies says. That they will divide you, that they will they will kill us and we will stop believing in God because they have taken it from us and we will separate ourselves. And by separating ourselves, we make ourselves inferior. We think in ourselves we are inferior, but we are not. We are of it. We are divine. That's why it is all in there. It's literally just a big, big puzzle. It's a puzzle. <laughs> and I was a puzzle kid. <laughs> I also watched The Wizard when I was young. Arcana is The Wizard. Arcana to heaven is 22. 22 in heaven is 7. 7th heaven, 22. Arcana is wizard. It's ascension and joker. It's child. And it's also victory. Victory of the gods. I uh, puzzled everything. I never lost. And Tommy never went home alone. I fail, and I never, I refuse to fail. I refuse to fail on you. I refuse to give you over to the enemy, as I refuse to give divine to you. And that is what is happening. That is the way this is not just a physical 3D, which you can see with your eyes. Because as Jesus had said, forgive him, Father, for what they do not see and do not know. It is for what we do not see. The spiritual realms and the war of spirituality, the good and evil. It's here, it's now, it's always been. We just have been blinded from it, my dears and my loves. So, hey, baby, it is time to wake up. It is time to stand, unite, and realize we are one. We are one of the conscious energy, one conscious energy. As even my breath, this air, it does not, uh, it does not care nor have boundaries. It's boundless in within my body and out, as it is all of yours in and out but the air is a frequency and so is my body and so is of yours and just because there is separation and division and a different density of a frequency or higher lower frequency and what our eyes can see what can be seen and cannot seen within 12 dimensions all that is was and ever will be is all connected we are all of energy matter is energy energy is frequency and we are of the higher frequency of the divinity we are divine frequency of God and all oneness. And I love you. And I want you to see, to realize, to see the clarity and the beauty of life. Because it's beautiful. And it's beautiful and it's here and it's ours. And it's now. It's ever changing, but it's always now. So now is time. It's now. I stand with you in love, not war. I stand to unite the brethren, but we do it right. I want to see the stars shine and below as above, because as above, so below, and peace on earth, so more to be. I love y'all. Let the sun shine in. Let's spin and spread this love around. Let's spread the truth. Come on now. I'm telling the truth. I told you I did not come here to fool you. I came to bring you back to the promised land, apparently. I'm bringing you back to truth. I love you. I love all. I love divine. <laughs> Trust, love, unity, solidarity. It's all there. Be it. Be change. And change is now. So be now. Love. Good night. God bless. I didn't feel his heart and soul. <laughs> I guess Mother Earth took her heart back. But fill his soul once again with your love, my lord. I will see you again, Carmen. <laughs> my love to you all. Mm -hmm.